against a four man rush. Blau over the middle. That is caught by Marshall. And that's a bad break for Purdue. Well, it is, but as an athlete, you got to know where you're running. Winner, Desmond King. Very dangerous. He makes the catch inside the 25. And Turbo's upfield to about the 33 yard line. They run as good as any corner in the country. Wow, under pressure here on second down, buying time. And he floats it toward the Iowa sideline, third. Doyle, of, coach, of course, the coach in the weight room does a great job with her weight program. Against a twist on third and long, pressure coming from Joe. Pressure, and he doesn't see his receiver come across the formation. Should give it to him right now. You know, he's probably about one count late on that. See the receiver come across and ends up balls just waiting. We have. <laughs> Gadot is about to arrive. David Blau under pressure. Squirts away. He's going to have to run it. Tackled from behind by... Blau again to the air on the slant. Incomplete. Blown the OC of Purdue. Hey, do you run at King or do you go away from him? And this time they choose to go at him. And D'Angelo Yancey just... Chopper with the punt, it takes a bounce at the 48. They're likely going to see two man again, and so Blau might have to run the ball. There's a screen pass, Herdman could not hang. Throw. We talked about that watching tape yesterday. When his feet are set, that's when his accuracy goes awry. There's Desmond King, he'll run this one back. Has the 20, flags come flying in. On the return, illegal block in the back. Return team number 15. Half the distance to the goal. First down, Iowa. Step aside early in the second quarter. All Hawkeyes. Wow's pass over the head of. That is caught. It's a first down. Gregory Phillips. Pressure around Blau, and he's able to step into the throw. Play action. Downfield. And the two fast trying to do. So they're going to stay close. Windows are going to be tight today, and Blau has to be on target. That's dropped by Marshall, third and long. After the play's over, personal foul on necessary roughness, defense number 14. 15-yard penalty. Uh, that's a bad mistake by a senior that's starting his 45th game, guys. You've got to be a little bit smarter than that after the whistle. Just don't expect that from Desmond King, the veteran. Erdman motions. Flea flicker. Wow. Chased by four Hawkeyes. And he's got him out. I, I thought he was outside the tackle box. We'll get a look at it here. See where he ends up throwing the ball, but... He's outside the hash. He's outside the hash marks. Boy, that that is really back now at the Purdue 45, second and long, near sideline. That's caught by Anthony Mahungu. A little upset that he didn't get more production out of this drive. Chopper with the punt. And 6 one 245-pound freshman. Wow, fakes to him. We'll take a shot downfield for Yancey, who makes the catch. The go route with Yancey. He gets past Desmond King, and then he makes a really nice over-the-shoulder grab right in front of King, who King had the great catch-up speed. That Worship might be the best guy to run between the tackles. Look at Worship right up the middle. Only got a yard that time, but he is old. There's a need to be relevant. No question. Big Ten. Oh, yeah. Markel Jones running to the outside, looking for some room, finally wrapped up by King Edward as the guy to lead this program. Yeah, they have a lot of young players, so it's it's time for the young players to step up, make plays. Wow, looking for somebody. How about the cover? Over the middle, incomplete. And it'll bring up. Erdman gets past Bauer and finally upended by Holland to get first downs. 
Play action. Blau. Downfield. Herdman makes the catch. Herdman. In. Love the play call. Terry Malone, the offensive coordinator. They boot away. Herdman down the middle of the field, down the seam, and Blau throws a great ball. Herdman finishes the play, gets in the end zone for the Boilermakers. Down. Yeah, I want to see evidence that, that Kevin Weidel passed that test. In the flat, Langford Johnson taken down at the 31. Listen, this is a, this is an uh, B club. They don't just let any, anybody in this niche. You know, I, I, I had to work today. It, it, I mean, I'm their 4 3 defense and then just walk a linebacker out. Broken up by the All American Desmond King. Third. Out of Oregon in 2009, Buffalo Bills selected him in the second round. He was with a heavy cover two scheme. Yep. You know, NFL safe, the prototype, you know who the prototype quarterback is at the NFL? Guy that looks like Tom Brady. And then for the the guys that are, you know, playing defensive safety, they're long, they're fast, and, they're, and they are rangy to Kevin's point. Look at one of the best in the league, Devin McCourty out of Rutgers. The Indiana game, the outcome of that impacts Iowa should they hold on. And it appears they will. It's third and ten. Wow on the move. Into coverage, intercepted by Desmond King. King inside the 10. End zone. 12th career interception. He had been waiting for a while, too. It had been 12 games between interceptions. He had eight last year. Finally, he gets a chance. Yeah, I, I, you know what? They kept going out at him. They kept going to his side. I was waiting. Interception return for a touchdown which is an Iowa school record. I love when, when someone catches the ball like that and then they're instantaneously on offense, right? He's a returner. He, he has one goal, get to the end zone. At number 14, he put on the Jets there too. Nice little move there. And then get back, he gets back outside. Hesse throws the last block for him. He's in for the score. That's been a talking point in Iowa City.